Yo guys, what is going on? It's Mr. DGM back again with another squad builder video. So as always, you guys have been leaving comments for squads that you want me to make and quite a few of you guys have been asking me to make a 600k team. So that is what I'm going to be doing in this video. So as always, guys, if you do enjoy the video, if you could drop a like on it, I would hugely appreciate that. If you are new to the channel, if you could also subscribe, that would also be amazing. So guys, we are going to jump straight into this squad builder video. So the formation is 4-5-1. However, I do actually change it in game to 4-2-3-1 with the three cams. So in goal, we have got the 84 informed Donnarumma, who I bought for 22,750 coins. Now, of course, this guy has got an 86 informed that you could get, but I went with the first informed just to keep the team in a 600k budget. So moving on to the right back position, I have gone with Daniel Carver Howe, who I bought for 6,600 coins. And so I do like this guy. I think he's a very reliable right back. Going forwards, I think this guy's very good. Defensively solid as well. So uh, yeah, I'm sure he would do well if you decided to get the team. So moving on to the two centre-backs now. Starting on the right-hand side with the 87-rated Kaladu Koulibaly, who I bought for 30,000 coins. The best Serie A centre-back on the game, in my opinion. And he's probably one of the best centre-backs overall on the game, to be fair. He is an absolute monster. So alongside him, we have got Kostas Manalas, who I bought for 12,750 coins. Great value for money. This guy is such an OP centre-back. 83 pace, 86 defending, 82 physicality. Some really good stats. So in the left-back position, we have got Alex Sandro, who I bought for 62,000 coins. The best left-back on the game, in my opinion. I think he's such a reliable player. Going forwards, he offers you a hell of a lot and defensively so solid. So moving on to the central midfield position, and I think some of you guys might be surprised to see this guy in the team considering he is only an 82 rated player, but he does what you need him to do, and that is just cut the pass lanes, win the ball back. He's got really good energy in game, and uh, yeah, I would recommend uh, having this guy in your team. So moving on to the left cam position now, we've got the 85 rated Fabinho, who I bought for 39,000 coins. Now, in my opinion, this guy is one of the most important players in this team. He's just there to break up the play, win the ball back and just get attack started for you. And uh, he does that so well. So moving on to the left midfield position, I have gone with Douglas Costa. Now, I actually had his loan card, but I think he costs around about 30,000 coins on the market. And uh, yeah, Costa brings great pace, dribbling, five-star skills. I just wish his finishing would be a bit better. That would be my only complaint, really. But apart from that, I do think he is a very good player. So moving on to the right camp position, I have got Roberto Firmino who I bought for 33,750 coins. Firmino was one of the star players in this team. I was playing him as the central cam, and uh, he plays that position so well. So moving on to the right midfield position, we have got Gareth Bale, who I bought for 218,000 coins. And uh, this guy's actually dropped quite a bit in price recently, and uh, I'm sure you guys know what Gareth Bale's about. Really is the complete player, really has no weakness. So we're moving on to the striker position now. We have got Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang, who I bought for only 143,000 coins. This guy has also dropped a huge amount recently. And uh, yeah, Aubameyang such a specialist at getting in behind and just scoring goals. So as you can see there, every player is on at least 9 chemistry. All the players would be on 10 chemistry if he did play 10 matches with the team. So in-game, I would change to 4-2-3-1 with the three cams, having Aubameyang as the striker. With Gareth Bale right cam, Douglas Costa left cam, with Firmino as the central cam, and then Fabinho and Allen as the two holding midfielders. So moving on to the custom tactics, I've been using these custom tactics for a very long time, but I do think these custom tactics suit this team's play style very well. So moving on to the player instructions for Bamiang, stay central, get in behind, stay forwards. For all three of the cams, I like to have them all to stay forwards, get into the box, and to free roam. And then for both Fabinho and Allen, I would tell them to cut the pass lane, stay back while attacking and to cover the centre. And then as always, I do keep both of the fullbacks on balanced attack. So we are moving on to my highlight choosing this team in foot champions now. And uh, overall in foot champions, I did manage to finish gold one. And uh, actually using this team, I won every single game. So yeah, I couldn't recommend this team enough. Going forwards, it is so deadly. You've got three of the quickest players on the game in Gareth Bale, Douglas Costa and Aubameyang. So the team really is set up perfectly if you wanted to counter attack. I was using it as more of a pressing team and uh, I think it can definitely do that with having players like Fabinho and uh, Firmino and Allen. 
that are all really good at that. So yeah, I would definitely recommend using this team. If you did want to upgrade the team though, there are a few upgrades you could go with. Now you can get any Serie A goalkeepers, so the likes of Handanovic or maybe upgrading Donnarumma to his second in form. I think that would be a good upgrade. You can get any Serie A centre-back in for Costas Manolas. So if you wanted someone like Chiellini or someone like that, you could go with them instead. And so you could bring in Felipe Coutinho in for Douglas Costa if you did prefer Coutinho. And uh, you can actually have any BPL striker for a Bamiang. I would probably recommend having a Bamiang, but if you wanted someone like Sergio Aguero or Lukaku or Kane, you could go with them if you preferred. So guys, I am going to be really interested to see what you do rate the team out of five because in my opinion, this is definitely the best 600k team that I have used so far. So uh, yeah, I'll be very interested to see what you guys do say. As always, if you guys uh, want to feel free to put more suggestions for squad builders you want me to make, feel free to do that. But that is just going to be about it from me for today. So I will catch you in the next video.